Welcome back to the Key Training Center's 24th Annual Run for the Money Telethon. We're doing pretty good, don't you say? We are doing great. It's, uh, yes. We're at the 3 o'clock hour, uh -huh. so we got a couple more hours to go. But I would say uh, the community, as usual, is coming out and supporting us. Right. But I want to mention the group that we have that has volunteered their time to come answer the phones today from the Citrus County Chronicle. And let me do a plug for the Citrus County Chronicle. You guys are All one right. of our <laughs> partners, um, um, Key Center partners, and I want to say thank you. Um, that's very significant. We've had nine businesses in the community that... Um, make an annual commitment to us with the Chronicle being one of those uh, organizations to help us educate the community on the good things that we do here. So on behalf of the key, I thank the Citrus County Chronicle for being one of our key center partners. Can we go ahead and introduce them? Sure, sure. And I you know they are? want this microphone I'm Carolyn Deckelman. Okay. I've cool. been with the Chronicle for 12 and a half years and been doing Run for the Money for five years. I was just going to say she's been one of our regulars. Regular. Regular, but close to a regular here. Claire Laxton editor of the Crystal River Current for the Chronicle, and I love helping the key. <laughs> <laughs> so being on the phone bank, you, you're like a regular here too, right? Like a regular. Yep, okay. I'm uh, Sharon Conrad, I work in the accounting department at the Chronicle, and this is my second year, and I hope it's one of many. Yeah, all right. Very good. Okay. And we also have a special guest with us. Our special guest is Troy, and Troy actually is new to the key. This is his first experience on the telethon and the softball game, which I, I understand. Now, you're, what team are you on the softball team? Team B? Team B. Okay, and how'd the game go? Uh, team A had won the first game, and Team B won the second game. Right, so, the okay. Key Center clients beat the sheriff. Yep. You're right? All right. Uh -huh. <laughs> and the thing about being at the Keys is that we are a family, and sometimes we do try our best, even though that. We're short on funds, but I would like for other people to actually come down and check out the Key Center, plus our thrift shop, sit around and talk to one of us and get to know how we really feel. Because I know the walking a mile on our shoe is not really the whole story. Very good, Troy. Very I good, tell you Troy, what, I couldn't you. say that better than yeah. that. You. you did awesome. Wow. Thank you so much for that. In fact, we do have tours. Um, we'd love for um, individuals, organizations out there, church groups or other Absolutely. organizations, give us a call and we would be welcome to give them a tour so they can see some of our group homes, our adult day training program. There's just so many things. Once you come and really yeah. learn what we do here at The Key, you'll be a friend forever. Friend forever. Looks like we're getting ready to go to Some entertainment, I think. Yes, yeah. we have Southern Exposure and they have, uh, uh, we've seen them periodically throughout the day. Great music, so uh, listen to this and be ready to come back and hear more about the Key Trading Center.